Bought a bad bitch, yeah. bought a bad bitch, bought a bad bitch. And I was just talking to Pluto. Bought a bad bitch, bitch bought a bad bitch, bought a bad bitch. Yeah, like you like them motherfuckers, don't you? They look good in fashion. Not like Hey, what is up guys? I'm your dog here. Today, I got a brand new video for you guys. I'm doing my stage two of the Obey Undead RC. If you don't already know Obey, all the links will be down in the description. Basically, we're doing a recruitment challenge for zombies players and content creators to try and get into the team. They already did the first stage. I ended up making it. And now this is the second stage. So they're gonna whittle it down 50 people from the first stage all the way down to 25 people. And this is gonna be my submission to see why I should get the 25. And basically, what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm just gonna compile a bunch of clips of my Dumbled records. And I'm basically just gonna talk over it, how I did it. Basically, just like talking over all my records. And at the end of the video i'll show you all my reactions they're pretty funny they're pretty like stupid we were just joking around at the end obviously we we're so happy we got the world record so hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure you smash the like button and it's the time you guys enjoy the video all right so the first record i want to talk to you guys about is my revelations 255 with mega gobble gums obviously mega gobble gums super easy game it's just take it's a matter of time at that point if you're using mega gobble gums yeah i ended up doing 255 but obviously like i said in my stage one video i don't like just going for a high round and playing the game regular i decided to make it a no power game so obviously that means i can't pack a punch to all that stuff no traps nothing like that but it is mega gobble gum so i still was able to use the pack a punch uh, squid and also the pack a punch thunder gun but i wasn't able to use AT. so when i got 255 i ended up getting four world records i got the high round obviously i got the flawless because it ended down once then i also got the no ats and the no power because with no power i don't get any ats also so in this game all around was pretty fun just to play it was pretty chill also so that's the 255 game all right so the next game i'm going to talk about is my 4p first room on ascension mega gobble gum we ended up getting 83 and beating the former world record by 11 rounds and and that world record was also the no power game so we also beat the no power and the first room record by a total of 11 rounds and this whole game was really easy so from basically 1 to 62 you're just spamming temporal gifts with raindrops and those joys everything like that just killing zombies as fast as you possibly can and then when it gets past 63 you actually have to start training because temporal gifts don't last long enough in the round so what you do is you have one person just training normally like in the spawn room all the three other players in the corner with their ats and they're just shooting them with the dead the zombies with their dead wire in their turn literally you're doing the whole game above 64 and what's very funny about this game is one of our players is from the uk so he went to sleep right in the middle of the game didn't tell anyone so we only had two players and the other guy and the other player obviously training so very funny how one of the players just fell asleep and we still managed to beat the world record by 11 rounds but yeah this whole world record was, it was a fun experience i liked it a lot it was just very chill nice talking to everyone so, so my next record is my 2p Varuk 30 speed run we ended up beating the former world record by 11 seconds and this world record obviously if you know anything about bo3 speed run you know reckless is definitely up there when it comes to the best speedrunner so we ended up beating reckless me and my friend and we beat him by 11 seconds so obviously in the video we were so hyped obviously beat the record and very it's very simple what you have to do it's just based on rng after uh doing it a couple that for doing like two days straight we obviously got used to it we just knew what we had to do we just we knew we had to get this amount of rng to get the world record and eventually we ended up getting it so basically what you do is you just spam, you stay in the spawn for five rounds spamming nukes just nuking every single round from one to five you run straight to speed cola and do the double window and you want one person to have temporal gift and then you want the other person to have fatal contraptions raindrops killjoys anything like that and it's very important you can know your gum cycle obviously because if you don't know your gum cycle you not you're not gonna know what gum you get next so that means you might get two temporal gifts at the same time which obviously that's horrible because then you have no fatal contraptions you know it's very happy when i got this you'll, you'll definitely see the clip i'll definitely put that in there the next game i want to talk about is my bo3 moon no ats game it's with mega gobble gums it's very easy but the strategy was a newer strat that no one really knew so that's why i did it and now i mean no one beat it yet it's very easy because I actually crash in the game. I don't even die. I crash. So the strat is fairly easy because you know, if you know anything about Moon, you know that the astronaut does not die past like 50 with no every gun you use. Use the Mark II. A whole Mark II won't kill him on 50. What you have to do is you have to switch strats. So say you have the, the obvious strat in uh, Moon is you camp in Tunnel 11 and just spamming your wave gun. But when the astronaut comes into Tunnel 11, you can't kill him. So what do you do? You go to the other side of the map on the other side of the door by stamina up, and you train in that room with your wave gun, and you just keep training and training until he finally comes to that room. And then you go all the way back to the other side of tunnel 11, do the same exact thing, spamming your wave when you just keep doing that back and forth, back and forth. It's very, it's very uh, new, interesting strat. And obviously, no one really knew about the strat until I finally made it. So very, it's fairly easy game. If anyone wants to go beat it, please go beat it. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's my game. My next and final record I want to talk about is my 170 and 50 speed run, all in the same game with tacos under sword cheese. If you know anything about BO3, you know how much of a legend tacos cheese is. And we eventually hit each other up and we we're just like, let's do this moon 100. We ended up doing the 100 speed run and we 
we died. Our first game, we died on 97. It was four and a half hours in. We died on 97 because I choked. I popped a cash back when we had a max ammo on the ground. But it pissed me off so much. I was so mad. And we were like, next day we're going to go for it again. I ended up going for it next day. And we ended up beating our times from the day before by like 10 minutes. We literally destroyed our record from before. So to be honest, the fact that I threw that game before was a good thing. Because we ended up beating the record by so much more time. Very proud of this game also because we destroyed the world record by like 12 minutes or something like that. So it was a very good game. Very, I, I, I was very happy about that game. So that was all the world records I wanted to talk about. I was showing you guys them. And the next couple of minutes, the next is just going to be me showing you guys my favorite clips from over the years. My reactions to get me getting the world records. YouTube videos I made. Everything like that. I'm just going to put it all into a small little montage. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you smash the like button. Put on post notifications. Follow me on Twitch. Top link in the description. And... I just shot my shot at this little dot. I'm trying to quit it next. No power. Proof. No power. I don't know what else I need to do. Can't watch it. No 80s. Okay. Who wants to tell me how to do the music Easter egg? Oh, one's right here. Okay. You said front row seat? Oh, yeah. My wings just came. Oh. Okay. One. And blue cheese. Yeah, it's over here. I think I remember it was over here. Yeah, right here. Okay. Oh god, we got it, we got it, we got it. <laughs> we got it. Hey. This gun in the field when you stick back. Ever shot a gun to that motherfucker click back. Ever got high off a drug car get controller. No, it's all good. What? No fucking way I just had the frames. No way I just had the frame lag. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. I told you, bro. People are gonna watch this and be like, yo. Those guys are sweating. Be like, yeah, we can't. We can't actually win this. Just. <laughs> I'm throwing in the towel. Imagine being the people. Oh, all day. For the. 70. Kinda sounds, sounds kinda cute. Got like one of those cute voices. Fuck him. <laughs> I have no mercy for my competitors. Let's go. <laughs> my, my, I have no mercy for my competitors. Yeah, yeah, yo, yeah, 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 yeah. Your motherfucking brains on the curve. I ain't do it personally, but this. Hey, we'll get below 38. We better get right. Yeah, we got 37. Yes. Nice. <laughs>